Prince Harry is a vocal champion of several worthy causes but he hasn't always been admired for his passionate approach to things. The Prince revealed how he was teased at school for one particular habit. Prince Harry, 35, was known as the cheeky royal growing up beside his sensible seeming older brother Prince William. While Harry was branded a royal rebel as a teenager the Prince was teased at school for this well-intentioned habit. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, 37, both championed environmental causes and were vocal about caring for the planet during their recent royal tour of South Africa. While Harry's focus on being green may seem like a zeitgeist trend, it stems back to his school days. Prince Charles was one of the first big names to champion environmental organizations as early as the 1970s. The Prince of Wales passed on this passion to his children. In a documentary released ahead of the Prince of Wales' 70th birthday last year, Prince Harry revealed how he was picked on at school for picking up litter. In the BBC One documentary about Prince Charles, Harry and William are seen watching old video footage of their father's speeches about causes close to his heart. One of the clips shows Charles warning about plastic pollution in 1970. In reaction to the footage, Prince Harry says, I used to get taken the mickey out of at school for just picking up rubbish. When you go for walks anywhere, if you see something, it stands out, you pick it up. Before you know it, somebody says, what are you doing? I've literally done this because I am programmed to do it because my father did it. And actually, we should all be doing it. Harry added, he's done an amazing job, without telling us what we should be doing or the direction that we should go in. He's just let us learn from the nature of the job, learning from him, learning from mummy. The documentary looked back at the prince's life and prophetic speeches he made about environmental damage. Earlier this year Prince Harry revealed he and Meghan only plan to have two children for the sake of the environment. Despite Meghan and Harry's attempts to raise awareness surround environmental causes have been criticized by some after the royals took a string of private jets this summer. Prince Harry has previously described single-use plastics as a dirty habit and said we all need to do our bit to help save the planet. Last night Harry gave an emotional speech about fatherhood at a children's charity gala. His voice cracked and he lost composure for a moment while speaking at the annual Well Child Awards in central London. Harry described how at the same event one year before he and Meghan had first known they were expecting Archie. Prince Harry began. Last year when my wife and I attended we knew we were expecting our first child and no one else did at the time, but we did. I remember. He then broke down, with host Davy Rosslyn stepping in to give him a reassuring touch on the arm before he regained composure. Harry continued, Sorry. I remember squeezing Meghan's hand so tight throughout the awards and both of us were wondering what it would be like to be parents one day and more so, what it would be like to do everything we could to help our child, should they be born with immediate challenges or become unwell over time. And now, as parents, being here and speaking to all of you, pulls at my heartstrings in a way I could ever have understood until I had a child of my own. The Duke of Sussex welled up while talking about parenthood with Meghan Markle at the Well Child Awards on Tuesday. During his speech, Prince Harry recalled how he and Markle had kept her pregnancy secret during last year's awards. It has been over a decade since I first came to these awards and every year they never fail to surprise and inspire me. Yet this year, it resonates in a different way, because now I'm a father, he said. Last year when my wife and I attended we knew we were expecting our first child, no one else did at the time, but we did, and I remember. The Duke then paused seemingly overwhelmed with emotion. With tears in his eyes, he continued, squeezing Meghan's hand so tight during the awards, both of us thinking what it would be like to be parents one day, and more so, what it would be like to do everything we could to protect and help our child should they be born with immediate challenges or become unwell over time. And now, as parents, being here and speaking to all of you pulls at my heartstrings in a way I could have never understood until I had a child of my own," he added. The purpose of the awards is to celebrate the inspiring qualities of some of the country's seriously ill young people and the dedication of those who go the extra mile to keep children healthy and happy, according to Buckingham Palace. 
Harry and Markle's attendance at the awards last year came just one month before Kensington Palace announced the couple were expecting their first child. At this year's event, the Duke and Duchess spoke about their five-month-old son, Archie Harrison, and confirmed to fans that he has ginger hair like his dad. Meghan said he has and Harry said he definitely is, you can see it in his eyebrows, one fan said of the conversation. Harry said he'd had no hair for five months, but Meghan told him she had taken him to playgroup and she said there were other children there with the same amount of hair or even less. 